Now, folks, I'm sure there's a reasonable explanation. Reasonable? Cornfield Clem is not reasonable. He's... It's a menace! I say we cancel everything right now, before someone gets hurt. <laughs> Who's Cornfield Clem? Local legend? Supernatural creature? Homicidal maniac? Just guessing. Are they really going to shut down the Halloween festival? Eh, uh, yep. Because of a scarecrow? Yeah, yep. That's crazy. Uh, yep. My friends, this festival is too important to our community, especially now that the toothpick factory closed down. <laughs> And I'm sure we can handle this without any more disruptions. Isn't that right, Sheriff Kern? Well, yes, Mayor Husk. But if I may add a brief word of caution, I think... Thank you, Sheriff. Duly noted. Now, let's all dig in and make this the best Halloween festival ever. Dumb old cornfield clam. Why do you have to show up now when I finally get to be Corn Cop Queen? Maisie, shh. He'll come after us. He already came after us. Excuse me, but can we talk? Sure do appreciate your business, kids. Say, if you're heading up to Little Moose Lake, you best get a move on. Those mountain roads can be mighty tricky come nightfall. Where are Shaggy and Scooby? <laughs> Scooby, are you okay? Don't worry about him. He landed on a cushion of freeze-dried ice cream. <laughs> Rocky uh, mm, Road. <laughs> Camp City Historical Museum. What's that? Oh, just a little hobby of mine. There's a lot of history in this area. Myths, legends, even a few ghost stories. You want to hear one? Nope. I'm good. My GPS, we should be able to see the camp right now. Hey, gang, check it out. Wow, that place is beautiful. To be honest, Fred, I wasn't too excited about roughing it, but I think I'm going to like Camp Little Moose. Oh, that's not Camp Little Moose. It's not? That's Camp Big Moose. That's Camp Little Moose. <laughs> Fix the place up. You've got to be kidding me. I've spent a zillion summers here as a camper, but now I'm finally going to be a counselor. It's my chance to pass on all our camp traditions to a new generation of little moose. This place is a dump. It's rustic. Man, I don't care what it looks like, as long as it isn't haunted. <laughs> Stop! Turn back! This place is haunted! Hey, buddy, what seems to be the problem? He's real! Get out of here while you still can! I'm going to Camp Big Moose! What was that all about? Beats me, but we're gonna find out. What part of Get Out Save Yourselves didn't you understand? How about this one time we listened to the wild-eyed lunatic? Fred. Maybe not every science project needs to be a booby trap. If I don't come up with an extra credit project, I won't graduate. You guys got any ideas? Like, how about the anti-gravity effects of caffeine? I know. My Uncle Ted invested in this new spa resort in La Serena. Here's a brochure. Nice. 
And there's a paleontological dig going on in town. Uncle Ted could get us a room in the spa, and you could volunteer to help on the dig. The best thing about this is Shaggy can go. It'll be totally relaxing and not scary. Look. La Serena, the least haunted town in America. <laughs> like, wow. It's officially certified by the U.S. Bureau of Supernatural Forces. We should go. Come on, Shaggy, it'll be just like old times, only without all the screaming. Yeah, I don't know, Fred. It says La Serena has three different all-you-can-eat restaurants. Wait, when do we leave? <laughs> <laughs> soon be approaching your destination. I thought you disconnected the GPS, Fred. It was a long drive and I needed directions. Except that on the way here, it took us to five chili joints, an all-night bowling alley, and a meteor crater. And don't forget the tattoo parlor, huh? Like I will never forget the tattoo parlor. When I flex, it looks like it's chewing. <laughs> Didn't the doctor forbid Shaggy to get into this van? He told him not to get into the mystery machine. That's why I repaid it. The mustard machine? Hope you kids enjoyed the ride, because I don't think I'll ever get the smell of Scooby-Doo out of my upholstery. Mm -hmm. That's right, I said. I think I'm gonna like, like this place. Aha! <laughs> if it isn't Frank, Danny, Veronica, and Slappy. It isn't. And you must be Scooby-Doo. I've heard so much about you. <clears throat> Are you sure he's a Great Dane? He seems more like some kind of wolfhound. I'm the dog. <laughs> you can say that again, Scabby. <laughs> Come in, come in. I'm so happy you're here. This is a great place you got here, Mr. Hubbley. Oh, no need to be so formal, Spanky. Call me Mr. Hubbley. Er, uh, um, uh, sh sp Shaggy. Uh, yes, we'll be open to the public next week. I would have made it bigger, but I couldn't get the locals to sell their land. Hmm, that's too bad. Yeah, but what are you gonna do? Dress up as a ghost and scare them off? <laughs> uh, oh, nah. Ah, still in perfect sync, eh, Scoob? <laughs> perfect sync. Like you got anything to eat around here, Mr. Hubbley? <laughs> Sorry, Saggy. There's an outdoor barbecue tonight in the town square. Hey, that's right near the dig site. We can have some dinner, then check out the dig. Okay, but don't come back too late. I'm making tofu chip cookies. Mmm, mmm. Got my saddle and my stirrups. Got my bridle and my reins. Halter bits and harnesses. Horse blood in my veins. But everything a cowboy could ever need, of course. But I ain't got no... Like singing makes me hungry. Everything makes you hungry, Shaggy. Well, yeah, everything. It's true. Even eating makes me hungry. Oh, come on. I know there's got to be some Scooby Snacks in here somewhere. Scooby Snacks? You'll be able to eat soon enough. We'll be in Sorghum City in a few minutes. Hey, thanks for inviting us along to your cousin's place. You said she found you on some genealogy website? Mm -hmm. Yep, and she was so eager to get to know me, she invited me to her dude ranch, like with guests. <laughs> I think this is our exit. Let me check. I've got the dude ranch's site up on my tablet. It looks like a nice... Oh, no. What? what? This is terrible. Look at this. They used El Cabong font. The whole website is El Cabong. What is it, a lost kitten flyer? Using El Cabong is like putting salt in someone's eyes, in everyone's eyes. We've had this talk before, Velma. A healthy person does not get this upset about fonts. <gasps> <gasps> Round one. One. Rock, paper, scissors. One, two, three. That is not how rock, paper, scissors works, and you know it! <laughs> Scooby-dooby-doo! 
It looks like this dude ranch has some fun activities. Roping, riding, even river rafting. Those are all words you can pronounce, Scooby. Roping, riding, river rafting, activities. <gasps> and there's a barn dance. I have the perfect outfit. This should be fun, as long as my horse allergy doesn't act up too much. I hope my medication works. Look, now entering Sorghum City. One more time! Me, 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 me. Please, not one more time. We're riding along the trail. Oh. Nothing but cow tails oh. in my side. Huh. Where are we supposed to turn? I don't know. Was that B Street or... Can we just ask directions? Why am I the only one who ever wants to just ask directions? I'll ask like I speak cowboy. <laughs> Howdy, partner. Hey, can you tell me where I can find... Ah! He's back! Pardon me, ma'am. <gasps> Howdy! <laughs> Must be something wrong with my accent. Partner, 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 par, partner, partner. Howdy, partner! Huh, they all sound good to me. We're looking for the crazy cute dude ranch. Uh, well, what you want to do is make a left turn there at Elm and... Uh... I don't get it. No one will talk to me. Oh. <laughs> Why am I so scary? Maybe it's the hat. Come on. <laughs> A whole week in Atlantic City. This is going to be the best vacation since Pismo Beach. Didn't we get attacked by a demon clam there? Okay, since Santa Fe. Where we were chased by those radioactive cactus monsters. Since Washington, D.C.? Washington. Hmm, Washington. What happened there? Hmm, Lincoln Memorial. <gasps> oh, yeah. The Lincoln Memorial came to life and tried to stomp on Scooby-Doo. Full scoring. Zoinks! <laughs> Calm down, guys. This is Atlantic City, the fun capital of the world. Nothing bad ever happens here. Well, gangland shootouts. Okay, yeah, obviously gangland shootouts. But otherwise, it's nothing but fun, fun, fun. Beaches and shows and... <gasps> My favorite band! Hi, gang. We have to see him while we're here. Their lead singer, Wolfric, is so awesome. He does that one song that goes... You think that's cool? Check this out. A circus! Remember how I explained to you what cool means? I love the circus. You know, I took that circus arts class last summer. We know. Well, my trusty hound. It appears that our art show has been a resounding success. It's the Falcon Flash. Ah, uh, ladies and gentlemen, something unexpected has come up. I'm afraid the art show is over. Not a moment to lose, Dog Wonder. Quick, to the Falcon's lair. You got it, BF. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> Dino Mutt to the Falcon Car! Blue Falcon! And Dog Wonder! Away! The Blue Falcon is just so cool! Played to perfection by the one and only Owen Garrison! That Dino Mutt is so amazing! And our costumes are like Groovy! I'm four! <laughs> <laughs> wow, you two! I've never seen you so excited over something that wasn't edible. Oh, it's edible. Yeah, we made the costumes out of string cheese and food coloring. 
We'll be the Blue Falcon and Dino Mutt for Mega Mondo Pop Comic Con a Palooza costume contest. And when it's over, we eat the costumes. It's like two for one fun. It's something. We are going to win that costume contest, buddy old pal. <sighs> I'm Dynamut, Dog Wonder. I don't know, guys. That old Blue Falcon TV show was pretty campy. But I gotta say, I'm really looking forward to the screening of the new, updated, darker, edgier Blue Falcon movie featuring mega movie star Brad Adams. He's cute in a dark, brooding kind of way. But you know what's even cuter? Littlest fuzzies! They're only the cutest collectibles in the whole wide world, and I have an almost complete collection. I've printed a checklist of all the various fuzzies I own, so that I'll know exactly which ones to buy at the Mega Mondo Pop Comic Con -a Palooza. Please. Costume competitions, movie premieres, obnoxiously cute collectibles. Ugh. I'm just glad the convention is supposed to be haunted by a horrible, mean, cruel monster man. Monster man? Yep. See? These two guards said a crazy freak attacked them in the dark. Smells like a mystery. No, it smells like a whole lot of Velma trying to ruin the most important weekend of my life. But that's not happening. Nope, no way. You can use the laptop after the convention. <laughs> well, it looks like the world can rest easy. Once again, Dino Mutt. That's right, BF. And remember, kid. It's the hero inside of you that saves the day. <sighs> like welcome to the Mega Mondo Pop Comic Con of Palooza. The greatest collection of comic books, TV shows, movies, everything. <laughs> <laughs> Jinkies! The mystery started already! It's the crab car! I love it! I love it! Hmm. I can see the only mystery around here is why I'm even at this Mondo Geekathon. Chicago is the third largest city in the U.S.? Like, I know it has the best pizza. Yeah, pizza. <laughs> Did you know Chicago has almost 200 art galleries? You really have no idea where my interests lie, do you? I still can't believe we're really finalists on Talent Star. Ah! Have I mentioned it's my favorite show? Once or twice. In this breath. Well, it is. And Brick Pimiento is the greatest host ever. Oh, there he is. I'm so excited. I really didn't think we were gonna make it through that last round of eliminations. Oh, come on, Daph. We had it sewn up. You know singers have the advantage. Hey, that's not the song we're doing. This is a little something I wrote myself. Wait, that's catchy. Eyes on the road, eyes on the road! Right! Wow, Fred, that's beautiful. I really like you. It. I like it, not you. I mean, I like you, but no. I, uh, like your song? Thanks. You guys are good, but me and Scooby are gonna beat you, right, Scoob? You betcha. Uh, you're not in the competition? We will be once Brick sees our amazing juggling act. You can't just audition the day before the finals. Like you can if you're awesome. Okay, we definitely want to hit the Field Museum. There's a Picasso exhibit. Oh, oh! The Mineralogical Society has the world famous soap diamond on display. Does it say anything in those books about the opera house where we're shooting the show? Yeah, it's almost 100 years old. It's been closed since the 70s, and there are rumors that it's haunted. Of course it's haunted. Like, when do we ever go to a place that is not haunted? Wait. Who's driving? <gasps> Green means go, right? Shaggy! Scooby-dooby-doo! <laughs> 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 